you are a scientist if you're uh, if you contribute to the knowledge uh, contribute new knowledge and that happens when you publish papers I'm Reina Reyes. I'm a data scientist and I've been uh, working as a data scientist for uh, a bit more than two years now. I went to Ateneo de Manila University for my bachelor's in physics uh, and then um, I got into a diploma program in high energy physics at the Abdus Salam International Center for Theoretical Physics which is in Trieste, Italy. So I spent a year there for that diploma program, which is like a jumping off point to graduate programs. Uh, so from there, I, I started my PhD uh, program in astrophysics at Princeton University uh, in the US. Um, yeah. And then after that, I did um, a postdoctoral you know, fellowship at the uh, University of Chicago. This line of work, data science, is actually very interdisciplinary uh, because uh, you work with different people from different backgrounds uh, who are actually, for example, um, with many, with, uh, we call them field experts. So they are the experts uh, with a lot of experience in the particular field um, that we collaborate with so we can incorporate those, those insights into our, our modeling and our analysis because uh, we, can, we are not experts for everything but we know how to deal with the data uh, and so uh, the insights come out when you work uh, closely with uh, the field experts and the business uh, people um, and together you come up with something that's useful and that has value for the company. Um, so there's actually a balance of solitary work where you're in front of the computer and then and work um, communi in communicating and collaborating with, with your team members. So I work on, I work on projects uh, and each project would be uh, geared towards uh, analyzing uh, a certain thing or wanting to, to um, answer a specific question about, about a business. Uh, and then that has a corresponding data set uh, that we can analyze um, to answer those questions. I usually work in front of a computer, so uh, my computer um, is set up to do um, uh, these um, uh, algorithms, and computations, and also visualizations to, um, uh, to mine the data for insights. Uh, I use uh, open source um, programming languages like uh, Python and R to do this uh, mainly. So um, most of the time is spent um, yeah, wrangling with the data in front of a computer and then of course communicating these results to, to my clients and to team members um, so that we can uh, process the results. Uh, look at um, further questions that come up uh, and then you go back and, and, and do and, and, and uh, refine your results for example. Education is very very important um, especially in this field because it gives you the fundamentals um, for um, for how you how you not only how you deal with the numbers, but how, how you think, how you think um, uh, logically, and also how you think creatively um, um, about the problem, uh, but also systematically. And I think that starts yeah, relatively early when our brains are still forming uh, at a young age in, in high school and even in elementary school so for me that was really really critical uh, I could trace my like my being a scientist becoming a scientist starting uh, at a young age uh, if you're still at that age uh, where before high school I highly recommend going to a science high school actually we have many uh, regional uh, science high schools in the Philippines uh, and then of course you have Philippine science high school campuses also around the country in the different regions 
um, and it gives you that that early start uh, in the science in the scientific uh, path. Um, just because just because um, you spend more time uh, you spend more time uh, in, in, in science. You have really good science teachers, and also you already have peers uh, with the same interests uh, as you do, and um, you help each other uh, grow. Um, of course, you can also, you know, uh, uh, be in a regular high school and still just have pay more attention to your science and math classes. The math is the foundation of, of science. Uh, so, um, um, that's important. And then, of course, uh, you can pursue a science career um, and then hopefully continue on to graduate school uh, where you become, you really become uh, mentored as a, as a research scientist where you, you do your own research and contribute to, to the scientific knowledge uh, of, human, of humanity.